This is what life looks like in places Israel told families to flee towards for their safety, where constant bombardment has reduced homes to rubble and wiped out entire families, these survivors say. I lost all my relatives, 15 people, this man says. We were not on the front line or anything, we were just sitting at home. What have we done wrong? The UN warns there are no safe places. About half a million people fled here to southern Gaza after an evacuation order by the Israeli military. But families, desperate for refuge, are still trapped in the war zone. The dead and injured flooding a healthcare system on the brink. Civilians are caught in the crossfire. With the death toll mounting, just over a quarter of those killed are children, according to Palestinian officials. And a week-long siege is strangling the enclave, the UN says, amid fears food, fuel, water and medical supplies may soon run out. Some two million people are crammed into this 140-square-mile territory, now many of them pushed into an even smaller corner of the enclave. About half the population are children. There are not enough shelters to house the sheer number of civilians, and even those who do find spaces in overwhelmed schools turned refugee centers, it is little comfort to the youngest victims. There is no one to protect us, this little girl says. There is no one to come save us. How are we supposed to live? How? Answer me. <laughs> Prime Minister Netanyahu has vowed to annihilate Hamas after a terror attack by the group left 1,400 killed in Israel. But with Hamas so deeply embedded within Gaza's population, rights groups fear a bloodbath. What we're seeing right now, the direction that Israel is going to, they is going in, they have said they want to destroy Hamas, but their current trajectory is going to destroy Gaza. Hamas does not answer to the people of Gaza. No elections have been held here since the group seized power in 2007. Still, it is these residents that will pay the price, and with a potential ground incursion expected, that cost is unfathomable.